everyone and welcome back to Music with Miss Innocent. Today we are going to be singing Ready for a Fight. In this song we are going to be practicing a little chant that has to do with knights in shining armor and we are also going to be practicing our rhythm. For this song I will be using a pair of rhythm sticks but remember if you don't have rhythm sticks you can always use pencils, chopsticks, utensils, anything you have around the house. And if you want to practice writing your rhythms with me, you might want to get something to write with and a piece of paper. On my paper, I have eight lines written to represent the eight beats that are going to be in this song. So let's get started. So for this song, I want us to imagine that we are knights in shining armor and we are getting ready for the battle. We have two words that we are practicing. The word is fight, and the second word is fray. The word fray is another word for battle, just like fight. It's an old word that we don't often use anymore. So again, imagine as if we are knights in shining armor and we are getting ready for the battle to be brave soldiers. To start, let's do a little bit of repeat after me. At this time, I am going to be tapping on my legs as I say my chant. So now, repeat after me. Ready for a fight. Ready for a fight. Ready for a fight tonight. Ready for a fray. Ready for a fray. Ready for a fray today. All right, you guys, now let's put those together. We are no longer going to repeat after me. You are now going to sing the whole song with me together. Ready for a fight tonight, and then ready for a fray today. Let's try it. Make sure you are tapping out the rhythm on your legs. And at the very end, we clap. And we'll talk about why we clap after this. Okay, let's get ready. One, two, ready, go. Ready for a fight. Ready for a fight. Ready for a fight tonight. Ready for a fray. Ready for a fray. Ready for a fray today. Good, one more time. Ready, go, ready for a fight, ready for a fight, ready for a fight tonight. Ready for a fray, ready for a fray, ready for a fray today. So now we are going to be using our rhythm sticks and I'm going to be tapping on this empty box. And remember, you can always tap on the empty box with just your hands if you want. So let's get started. We're gonna tap the exact same words in the exact same rhythm, but this time instead of tapping on our legs, we're gonna be tapping with our sticks. Ready, here we go. Ready for a fight, ready for a fight, ready for a fight tonight. Ready for a fray, ready for a fray, ready for a fray today. Again, ready for a fight, ready for a fight, ready for a fight tonight. Ready for a fray, ready for a fray, ready for a fray today. If you happen to have somebody in the house you can play along with, instead of tapping your sticks together, you can tap your stick opposite with the person as if these are your knight in shining armor and you are using your swords. So for example, it would be ready for a fight tonight, ding. But if you do this, remember to be safe and remember to be careful. So now let's try and figure out the rhythm of this song. At the very beginning, in the very first beat, we have the words, ready for a, ready for a. That has four sounds in one beat, ready for a. The note that we use that has four sounds in one beat is called ticka ticka. Can you say that? Ticka ticka. And it looks like this. So, we know that our first beat is ticka ticka. When we are drawing ticka ticka, we have four stems, then we add two beams on top, 
and then we add the little circles on the bottom which are called the note heads. And remember Tikka Tikka's have two beams on top. So we know that our first beat is Tikka Tikka, ready for a. And the next beat is fight. We only have one sound there, fight. So we are going to put ta, ready for a fight, Tikka Tikka Ta. And then we repeat that, ready for a fight, ready for a fight. So it's going to be exactly the same for the next two beats. Ready for a fight, ready for a fight, Tikka Tikka Ta, Tikka Tikka Ta. And now for the last four beats, we have ready for a fight to, ready for a fight to. So we have Tikka Tikka T T because fight to has two sounds and for TT that has two sounds in it. Tikka Tikka T T. And for our last two beats, we have night clap. So in our clap, we don't have any words. So we are going to put a rest on that last beat and for this one we had only one sound so we are again going to put ta. So I'm going to put the rhythm we just wrote together on the screen and I want you to use your finger to tap along to each note that you see as we say the chant. So first let's say the words and then we'll practice with the rhythm. One, two, ready, go. Ready for a fight, ready for a fight, Ready for a fight tonight. Good. Now let's practice saying the rhythm. One, two, ready, go. Tick a tick a ta, tick a tick a ta, tick a tick a ti ti ta, rest. So as a reminder, remember that a rest looks like this. And a rest is a symbol that means there is no sound there. It still gets a beat but it does not get sound. So now we are going to go one more time back with our rhythm sticks. We are going to say the words of the song. Then we are going to say the rhythm of the song. And then for our last challenge, we are going to tap the rhythm of the song with our sticks and keep the rhythm and the words in our inner hearing. So for example, I'm not saying the words, I'm not saying the rhythm, I am saying them in my head and practicing my inner hearing. So again, first with the words, then with the rhythm, and then only with our sticks. Let's try it. One, two, ready, go. Ready for a fight, ready for a fight, ready for a fight tonight. Ready for a fray. you guys so again I hope that you enjoy this one we practiced ticka ticka today and we also practiced using our rests remember if you have a friend you can always practice tapping your swords together on that rest we also practice the words the rhythm and our inner hearing so I hope you guys enjoyed this one stay safe at home and I will see you next time Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye, everyone.